everyone welcome back to my channel and welcome to a brand new video how are you all so as you can tell from the title and the thumbnail today's video is going to be a huge primark haul so you may have seen at my last video the come shop with me to primark and i obviously you might have guessed that i come away with quite a few bits um yeah some home things some beauty things some clothes so a little bit of everything in today's haul. So grab your drinks and your snacks um, and get comfy. And um, this is my mug from Home Bargains. I bet you've seen these. A lot of people have been buying these. Um, I uh, vlogged these in a haul um, a couple of weeks ago. There was only, I think it was £1.49. Um, and they had this colourway and then they had the whole opposite colourway as well. And I absolutely I love it. So I have got my coffee this morning. So grab your drinks, grab your snacks and please continue to watch. Right, let me put my uh, coffee down and we'll start. Oh, this, uh, by the way, is um, if you saw my Nihao uh, jewellery um, haul, this is my jogging suit that I showed in there. I had it in two different colours, the lighter one and the darker one. I gave my sister the um, dark chocolate brown one um, and I kept this, but it is so cosy and for the, for the price that the it's absolute bargain anyway because sometimes people comment like where my uh, jumper is from or whatever so i thought i'd just mention it and it's so cozy so getting on with the primark port right so the first thing oops picked up were two of these cushions so I bought two exactly the same and they also do these if you don't like the square ones they also do i think it was the same pattern but in the um, rectangle shape um they also did them so these are 12 pounds each 19 inch by 19 inch if anybody is interested in the size and i just thought it was nice for the price i like the color uh, color i like the tufty bits <laughs> i like the tassels as well on each of the four corners so these are not to go on our settee. These are to go on our uh, bed. We've had a new bed, uh, like a creamy, beige colour. Um, so I thought I needed some new cushions because my old bed was grey and I had some grey cushions on it. Um, so, yeah, I wanted to buy some new cushions, but I didn't want to spend massive amounts on them. Um, they're not choppable, though, with the inserts that they've got in them. But I'm not that bothered I don't think whether they are or not but if you are bothered uh, these aren't very easy to to chop um but yeah so these are going to go on our bed and I just want to get um a throw now to go on the bottom of the bed and maybe a couple of other cushions as well to go with these so I can have uh two and two uh two at the back and then two in the front maybe just to make it look you know a bit nicer uh but yeah really chuffed bits with those and yeah a good price I thought now, if you are regular here, you will know that one of my favourite things to buy is pyjamas, as well as mugs and notebooks. <laughs> and pyjamas is my one of my favourite sections, definitely, in Primark. So, I couldn't resist and I had to treat myself to these. You will have seen these in the Come Shop with me if you watched it. I got them in a medium. They were £13 for the set. They feel really nice material. So, they do these um, in a short sleeve top and shorts which is obviously what I picked up because uh, I do get quite hot but if you want long top and long bottoms they do those as well and I think they were £15 so only a couple of pounds more than the short ones and these come in so many different colours obviously I've got the beige with the cream trim but they had cream, black, navy, um, at least those colours uh, they probably had some more as well again both in both different styles so i got those because i just thought they were really nice they look really nice and they feel really nice quality and they say 50 percent recycled polyester and yeah they feel so comfy so really excited to try those on oh actually shall i do a try on i'll insert the trials i haven't tried any of this on yet but I'll insert the try-ons after anything that I've bought for myself because um, I always like to see it when people try things on. So I always like to do the same. So I'll try the pyjamas on now. 
So these are the pyjamas, these are a keeper. They are a little bit big, because I got them in the medium, but um, you know, you want pyjamas loose really, don't you? And to be comfy and cozy and slouchy. So yeah, like I say, feel really nice material. So yeah, I'm pleased with these. So the next thing I got, this is for me as well. This also came in different colours, but obviously I got the brown colour. And it's just this long sleeved top. It's got beautiful like cable knit detailing on it. I know we always say how oh, everything's so soft or whatever on YouTube, but this does feel again really nice quality. It feels really soft, really nice material. It says product made using a minimum of 50% sustainable viscose. And I got it in a small and it was £10. Um, so I'll try this on for you guys in a minute. Like I say, they did come in different colours. And I thought for £10, it wasn't bad um, given uh, how nice the material feels. And I just thought, I don't like to wear a really thick big jumper and then a big thick coat. But I thought with this, I could layer it up with either one of my gilets or my a coat uh, because I don't like to be too bulky but I thought with this being like fairly thin but with a nice big chunky coat this will be absolutely ideal and then if you're going anywhere as well and you've got a thick jumper on sometimes you get too hot you know if you're going in shops and going around the shops or out for some um, lunch or something so I just love anything like more like this kind of thickness so anyway pick that up so I'll try that one on for you yeah, I really like this. Um, really cosy, really comfortable. I probably just wear it with some jeans and then, like I say, um, a coat or jacket over the top. So, um, yeah, love this. Very nice. I'm keeping this one. Feels really nice. Right, what else have I got? I'm just coming to whatever I come to, if you know what I mean. I'm just going to vlog whatever I come to. So, I had to pick up these and um you know, I've already got my autumn decor out, but I'm going to add these in and obviously I will get them out year after year. But I just couldn't resist them because they were only £2.50 each. I mean, you just, you know, you can't go wrong, can you, for that price? So I just picked up one in the cream and one in the brown. I just think they look so cute. I like the little stalks. So, yeah, I just picked up two of the little pumpkins and they will go anywhere. So I'm going to find a place for these little beauties. But like I say, I couldn't I couldn't miss them because things like this quite often you can't get, can you? You know what I mean? When you want them. So I thought I am going to get them while they are there. And then we'll stick with some another home item, if you like. Let me just get this out. Oh, hold on. It's quite heavy. She's wrapped it up for me, though. So that was good. Because most I always see people on with the Primark cores, and a lot of times I've got like the um, homeware and, and vases and things wrapped up, and I never get mine wrapped up, so <laughs> they never wrap mine up, but today they have. So, picked up this. I think this is so nice as well for the price. This was only, yeah, six pounds. I mean, you can't go wrong, can you? And I just love the pot that it's in, as you can see. It's obviously like a creamy colour. It's got like a little bit of a, a pinky, goldy. Well, I thought it looked a little bit, I don't really know, but slightly rose goldy, uh, which will go in our kitchen. So that's where this is going to go. Um, so I'm going to style this up in there. And it's obviously just an artificial plant. It's got the little um, pebbles in the top. And I just thought that looked really nice. And what an absolute one's bending a bit down but I think you can bend it I don't know whether you can or not but anyway <laughs> six pounds I think that is absolutely beautiful like I say absolutely love that pot on it and it's got a lot of weight to it and I don't think that looks cheap at all I mean obviously it is artificial but I don't think it looks really artificial I don't think it looks really naff you know sometimes it can look a little bit over fake can't they, if you know what I mean uh, but I love an artificial plant, so I absolutely love that. I'm absolutely chuffed to bits with that. And again, for the price, I mean, everything's going up, isn't it? But for that, I mean, you'd pay more in b and I reckon, for something like that. Maybe like £10. So I think that's a good, bar a good bargain for £6. Then, so pleased to have got my hands on these. I absolutely love these velvet plush leggings. These are so nice. If you have never bought any of these, I highly recommend them. So they are still only, oh, I've got to say six pounds. They are, they've gone up a pound. 
they're seven pounds now i'm sure there were six last year I got them in a small to medium. They are the Velvet Plush Leggings, regular length, extra warm. Now, I don't know whether this is the camera's picking it up, but these are a really dark brown. So I've got them in black, though I could probably do with a new pair of black, actually, as well, because uh, I have absolutely lived in them. These are so nice for the autumn and the winter. They are so soft, so comfy, so cosy. And as you can see, and you probably know if you are a regular here, I am all about the comfort. Love it. So these are absolutely ideal and they come in so many different colours now. So I was going to get the lighter brown. They've got like more of a beige, maybe like this colour. Um, but then when I saw the dark chocolate brown, I was like, no, I'm having that. So they've got that colour, this sort of colour, or a bit darker than this, maybe. Then they've got like a cream, they've got black, uh, they've got navy. So they've got, yeah, a, quite a wide range of colours if you can get your hands on them. Um, and if you've not seen inside, look how nice they look. Absolutely, yeah, love those. So, uh, shall I try these on? I may as well try them on for you. I mean, they're only leggings, but yeah, we'll give them a whirl. So, something like this is what I'm thinking of wearing with these leggings. So, I've just got my um, Ugg um, slipper style shoes on and some thick, chunky socks. Um, and then maybe this um, jacket, something like that. Um, but yeah, absolutely, I love these leggings, so cosy, so these are a no-brainer, <laughs> I'm definitely keeping these. Right, I'm going to move on now to some beauty bits, because between me and our daughter Kaya, we have got quite a lot. So, the first thing I picked up was this hair mask. If you saw, again, on my Come Shop With Me, they had had loads of new in beauty things that I hadn't seen. I don't know whether this is new in, but I hadn't seen it before. But they had lots of things in their skincare, uh, beauty makeup that I hadn't seen. And this was one of them. So they had loads of hair treatments. So these, let me get my glasses because it's got quite small writing on. So these hair masks were only one pound. I mean, you can't go wrong. And I got the one for blonde hair, obviously. Expertly blended to brighten and tone blonde hair with violet pigment, suitable for use on natural or colour treated hair. It's vegan friendly and yeah, a pound. And they had loads of different ones. They had restore ones. They had ones for curly hair, loads of different hair treatment masks. Then the next thing I wanted to get some retinol. I like to use retinol. I don't buy a high strength one. I just get it from somewhere like Primark. I'm not sure whether I have had this exact one before or not from there. I think I possibly have. Um, but retinol's good, isn't it, for older skin? I mean, I don't know whether you have to use it really if you're, if you're really young. But um, £4.50 this retinol night serum is. It's only 0.3% pure retinol. Targets the signs of ageing. Vegan and dermatologically tested. So, yeah, always like serums. My favourite serums, I think, are vitamin C serum and retinol. Um, somebody asked what I use um, on my skin. And to be, to be fair, <laughs> to be truthful, I use a little bit of everything. I do like some of the higher uh, end stuff. And if I get it for Christmas or for presents, like I love the Charlotte Tilbury Magic Cream, I love the Elemis Cleanser, I love the Clinique Day, Take the Day Off Cleanser, some of the more higher range ones. But if I'm just sort of buying them for myself and it's not a gift, I buy it from Primark. I've got some of the La Cura um, uh, Moisturiser. I've got some Liqueur Serum from Aldi. I've got Retinol Serum, uh, obviously from Primark, Vitamin C from Primark. So, yeah, uh, but I do swear by Retinol and Vitamin C. And then my daughter wanted some new Beauty, sp uh, beauty Blender sponges. And uh, you could get a pack in there, to, a pack of two for only £1.50. And obviously they did loads of different ones. They also did the little ones as well, the powder puffs the whole shebang and they were £1.50 and then my daughter also picked up this now I've not seen this in there before it was £3 it's quite hard to read you can't really see the writing very well on it but it is hair texture powder for volume 
And even with my glasses on, I can't even read hardly what that says. Expertly blended to add volume and body to hair. So if you wanted a little bit, I mean, actually, I could do with some of that for myself because my hair probably is a little bit flat. Um, so I could probably do with a bit of a zhuzhing up. Um, so, yeah, that's like I say, my daughter picked that up. But actually, I might give that a whirl. I bet it's a bit like um, dry shampoo. Do you know what I mean? Like, because dry shampoo, um, that can give you a bit of volume, can't it? As well as, you know, when your hair wants washing. So it's probably like that, but not with the, like, to battle the greasiness, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, then me and my daughter both picked up one of these. So these are exactly the same. Oh, I'll have to put my glasses on. I should have just left them on. So this is a hair mascara wand. It's called Tame. It was £2.50. And it's hair mascara, or it's mascara for your hair. But it's obviously going to be clear. Um, so I have actually, I haven't used it this morning, so I've probably got some flyaway bits. But I have got the Rehab one, the Rehab hair mascara. And that is fantastic, absolutely great. But it was obviously a lot more than £2.50. I'd say it probably was about £20, but don't quote me. But it is fab. So if this one isn't any good, I shall go back to using the Rehab one. Um, but obviously it's just, if anybody doesn't know, I'm sure you probably do. It's just like a mascara wand and you just put it on your um, flyaway bits, your bits here. Um, so, in fact, shall I open it and see if it works? Because one of them is mine and for the price, let's see if we can... I'll have to come in closer. I mean, nobody really needs to see a close-up of my face. However, I think, oh, it's alive. I think, let's open it and see. So like I say, it's just like uh, a mascara wand. I can't see with my glasses on or with my glasses off. So I can't really see very well in here. But you just go like that and it's supposed to tame down your hair. So I don't know whether you can tell. I can't tell whether it's in this, in this little mirror on the camera i can't tell whether it is working i don't know whether you guys can at home or not uh, but that is what you do with it i don't know whether that's working or not it doesn't feel very wet Imagine this, that that bit feels wet but that bit doesn't so perhaps it's just the brush is that working I don't know, guys. I don't know whether you can tell. But if it does, fab. If it doesn't, I'm going back to the rehab one. But for £2.50, I thought I've got to try it. Right. Now, my daughter wanted some pyjamas. She is a little bit like me. She loves her PJs. And let me just move my coffee over so I don't dangle the bottom in the, in the cup. So she got these in a medium because she likes her pyjamas oversized. These were £12. And they, again... <laughs> Again, they feel lovely quality. These are just these long pyjama bottoms, quite wide leg. Um, and they also did these in shorts and also in a nightshirt. So how nice are those? For £12, yeah, they feel lovely. Right, what else have we got? Oh, I think, oh, I bet she didn't mean to get um, these in the shorter length. She's made a boo-boo there. Um... My daughter picked up these, <coughs> excuse me, but she's picked them up in the shorter length and I, I'm sure she didn't mean to. So I'll have to ask her whether she meant to get those. So she got them in the black. She loves these as well. So they're just the same as the chocolate brown ones, uh, but these are black. But yet, yeah, so they do come in a shorter length or regular length. So I'm going to have to ask Kai if she meant to get the shorter length. I am sure she didn't mean to. So I think they're going to have to go back and swap them. But it's good to know that they do them in a shorter length if you're interested. Right, another home bit. So sorry, it's just all, all muddled up. I'm not sticking with the home or whatever and putting them all together. I'm, I'm just uh, coming, you know, vlogging whatever I come to. So picked up a candle. Uh, what am I doing with my glasses? There we go. So, as you guys know, or if you are regular here, you will know I can't smell. So, I don't know what it smells like. I can't sort of comment. I just got it for the aesthetic. But my husband said it smelled nice. It's patchouli and vanilla scented candle. Burns up to 40 hours. So, even though I can't smell, it's nice to have candles burning. If you've got people coming around, just to make your house smell nice. Though it does 
upset me a little bit that I can't smell it, but hopefully it smells nice. It was £4.50, but I bought it because obviously it's like neutral and it's got the wooden lid. And I do like candles with lids just so they don't get all dusty because they're messed up. I don't know. I just like them when they're covered up with the lid. So, yeah, I bought this for aesthetic purposes more than anything else. But if you like patchouli and vanilla, then that might be the candle for you. So, got that. Next thing, couldn't come out without the cosy socks, could I? And you get two, pair, two pairs for two pounds. So, I think they're the same price as last year. So, a pound a pair. And they probably don't last that long. And I think they probably do molt a little bit. Uh, but, I mean, yeah, for a pound a pair, I mean, what, what's not to love, really? And I just loved the colours and the patterns. So you've got the plain one with the uh, beige heel and then the sort of, I don't know what they've got on. Just, I don't know, markings on them. I don't know what they're supposed to be. But anyway, absolutely love those. Love cosy socks, love slippers. Two pairs for two pounds and they had loads in store. I've been wanting to get some of these for a while and I finally was able to manage uh, to manage to pick them up. So they are the two wrist wash bands. So they stop water from running down your arms while cleaning your face. Yeah, I mean, they're not an absolute necessity, are they? But for £1.50, when I'm cleansing my face, I hate it when all the water runs down and gets all over my arms. So for £1.50, what's not to love? And they come in a nice pretty pink colour and they also come in an animal print as well. So pick those up. What's this? Oh, uh, my daughter loves the Carmex, so she picked one of those up. That hasn't got the price on it, so I'm not sure how much that one was. But they always sell the Carmex lip balm, don't they, in there? Though I've noticed they sell it. I'll get it a bit warm now. Um, I notice they sell Carmex quite often in home bargains as well, don't they? Then I've got one of these, but my daughter wanted to pick one up. Oh, I should have took my glasses off. So it, it was £4.50. Now... I don't know whether I'm going to pronounce this right, so forgive me. Is it a gushar? Gushar? I don't know. But I'm sure you know what they are. The things to massage your face. So I think I have got one. And I'm sure you hold it like that, don't you? And you massage your skin with it like that. So, I mean, not convinced my daughter really needs one at her age. But I don't know. But, yeah. She wanted to pick one of those up. They also had the face rollers as well. If anybody, uh, you know, like the jade face roller things. They also had those in store as well, if anybody's interested. Then I've got a couple more bits left to share with you. I have had this pack of bras before and I absolutely love them. If you like a comfortable bra, then these might be the ones for you. Two pack seam free push up bra. I got them in a medium. Obviously, this uh, colourway is black and white, uh, but they did have a couple of other colours as well. But I just got them in the black and the white. They're £12 for two bras. So £6 a bra. They seem free. They've got this really nice thick waistband, uh, which is band around the uh, bottom, which is why I love them. Uh, because I love a seam free. They're so comfortable. They do give you support as well, <clears throat> I think. I find them quite supportive. They've got the padding in um, and they've got the big band, which I really like. I absolutely love them. I can't rave about them enough. Um, so, yeah, I highly recommend these bras. Um, so comfortable and a great price as well. So what's not to love? And then the, is that the last thing? Yeah, this is the last thing in today's haul. So I hope you guys are still with me. It's got all bits on. Oh, I thought it was a mark, but it's just fluff. So, got these. So, these are um, cargo straight. These are men's, sorry. These are at the men's. These are for my husband. These are cargo straight uh, cargo trousers. So, obviously, they come in different waists and different leg lengths. And they also did come in different colours. These were £18. And me and my husband both like a cargo trouser. These are not the, um, they're not the parachute ones. They're not the really baggy ones. But they are quite baggy. They've not got the um, elasticated bottom or whatever. They're just like that at the bottom. They haven't got, oh, they have. I was going to say they haven't got that bit, but they have. So, let me show you. So that's the front, so they've got the side pockets, 
They've got the pockets obviously on the legs and then the pockets on the bum there as well. Straight fit. They are classed as, and like I say, different colours, but my husband wanted black. More for the autumn, winter. He's got like a khaki uh, style one and a beige, um, different styles. But yeah, so we both like those sorts of things. And they're so comfortable, aren't they? I mean, jeans are obviously good as well, but they are a bit more comfortable. So that is everything in today's haul. So I really hope you have enjoyed watching. If you have, please click the like button. And if you'd like to comment, um, if you are a regular here, you know I always reply to every comment. And if you are new here, um, I always reply to every comment. <laughs> and I love to read your comments. Uh, maybe say if you've picked up any of these items or if you're hoping to get your hands on any of these items or yeah. And as always, I always ask ask for requests for videos. Um, on my last couple of videos, I've had quite a few requests in. Um, so they will definitely be coming up on my channel in the next few weeks. I mean, if you request something, I'm not saying I'm going to do it like the following video, but I do keep um, a note of anything anybody requests. And if at all possible, over the coming weeks, I do film them. So uh, people have requested a garden centre tour. Um, so I think I'm going to wait till the Christmas decorations are all out uh, because our local couple of garden centres, they both have fantastic Christmas decorations. So that's been requested. Um, a home tour. Um, so I'll, I'll probably going to film a tour of our house um, a few come shop with me's have been requested for the christmas stuff coming in the range poundland marks and spencers yeah so all those things will be coming up on my channel in the in the coming weeks so anyway i will let you guys go and i will see you all uh, in my next video take care of yourselves bye